welcome back to House Beast Game Corner. So Welcome today what we're going to do is go ahead and uh, like continue with part two of the Char story today. Um, we already finished up part one with uh, both the first and second episode there that I did uh, in the last two videos. So today we're going to go ahead and start the second one. See how far we can get, see if we can get it all done. Again, all of this is still pretty new because I haven't done the Char story in full. Um, I've done the Norn story, the Azuran story. Uh, and the Silvari story I think I did like a couple of times so this is all still pretty new to me so let's go ahead and get started um, our first uh, mission here is going to be an unusual inheritance so we need to report to Trim's, Tribune uh, Brimstone's office at the top of the Imper Imperator's core okay so here we are at uh, Imperator's waypoint um, this is pretty much where we're going to need to go to get to the office. Uh, if you guys remember from our last video, the office is right around in here. So here's our story marker. Let's go ahead and start it. That's a really cool uh, background too, that uh, loading screen. It's pretty awesome. I want to say that's uh, Ritlock right there. some news I wanted to deliver to you personally. Cub, I am sending this missive as I've been wounded in action and am slowly succumbing to my injuries. I have to tell you, years ago, my war band and I found a strange treasure in the ruins of Greenwich Courthouse. We couldn't divide it up, so we struck a deal. The last to survive would inherit the whole thing. As it happens, I'm the last survivor. However, as my life is coming to an end, I'm leaving it to you. We broke the key to the treasure room in half and hid the pieces in separate locations. Look for a chest submerged within Windrock Maze. Its combination is hidden on the walls of the maze. The second half of the key is in Lamia Meyer follows is in Lamia Meyer. Follow the old fashioned markers uh, that we left on the trees. If you find the treasure, it's yours. Think of it as my legacy. Live well, be strong, be victorious. Your father, Argus Fool Killer. Okay, so that's the letter that we got. Looks like we got that from Ritlock. We have to talk to him again. My sire's letter says his warband found treasure near the old Greenwich courthouse. They hid it until only one more bandmate was left to claim it. Unfortunately, my sire's entire warband went down together, so it falls to me. Very interesting. I've always suspected that courthouse held valuable relics. I used to explore around there when I was a cub. You've got me curious. If that treasure is a powerful or valuable human relic, the Imperator will need to be informed. I'm relieving you of regular duty until you track this down. Report back to me as soon as you know anything. All right. Okay, so we're gonna go look for the inheritance. Search Windrock Maze for clues. Let's take a look and see where Windrock Maze is. Mind you, I don't really have any waypoints here, so I'm gonna have to run everywhere. So give me a few moments, and uh, we'll see you over here at uh, Windrock Maze. All right, so here we are, Windrock Maze. We found our story marker, so let's go ahead and jump into it. Um, Again, another beautiful background here uh, by their creators. All right, there's Dinky. We gotta go meet up with him. Once on a dare, I swallowed a thumbtack. I like the mazes. It's fun to be lost on purpose. So what's the plan, boss? All right, so we're gonna take Dinky with me. Lirsh is gonna search to the left, and Zemmer is gonna go to the right. <laughs> Okay, let's 
So if they're going left, we're going... If they're going left and right, we're going straight. Okay, so we're gonna have to fight some skilk here. Refreshing. So we have a suspicious rock we have to check out up here. We have to get rid of these skulks so we can take a look. Still, I'm still trying to get used to my buttons, and believe it or not, I did play a little bit during the week. I remember the code, boss. Well, I'll remember we have it. Someone else needs to remember the digits. I think I'm just gonna have to come up with a new way to bind my keys so that it's uh, a little bit more comfortable than what I have set up right now. Alright, so I just started a fight with a bunch of um, sparks for pretty much no reason. Oh wait, yeah, that's the trail up here, okay. I like life transfer, especially when there's a lot nearby. Um, it's usually the last thing I'll do once I notice that we're going to start uh, getting low on health. One of the main things I like doing is using Signet of Spite because it'll send all those conditions in an epidemic because it'll transfer them to multiple enemies around from one to another. Unfortunately, though, it used to be a lot stronger than it was, uh, and then they made an edit. Uh, and then it actually got too strong, so then they just nerfed it. Um, and pretty much, I think they halved everything for Epidemic. Okay, so now we have to go to our last marker uh, and find one more, uh, find one more good fragment. It's gonna be over here. And, uh... Okay, we're gonna have to fight this veteran Shadow Skelk. Like all Skeletonics, this one is a loathsome collection of mud, sticks, feathers, hair. Unlike most Skeletonics, this one is mishappen, misshapen. Like it was built over something unusual. So let's go ahead and clear it off. I think there's something unusual here, so let's figure it out. Okay, that's the last bit of code. Time to unlock the chest. Oh, the code, boss. Well, I'll remember we have it. Someone else needs to remember the digits. <laughs> okay. Alright, that's pretty funny. Alright, so... I have to get the key from the hidden chest, and that's going to be in here as well. Down below. Oh, water fight. I don't... Okay. Uh, I never set any attacks for underwater, so I kind of can't do it now, but that's okay. This isn't a very hard um, boss to fight. Especially if you're a necro. <laughs> okay, so now we go down to the second chest. 
Tarnished metal chests is secreted under, uh, secreted away under the rocks. Sand sediment clogged the combination lock, but the mechanism appears to be functional. So let's go ahead and enter the combination 804. All right, and we're done. So now we just choose a reward here. Uh, let's see, they're all less than what I already have. So we're just gonna pick a uh, random one. They're all soulbound, they can't be traded in between, and it's probably gonna get destroyed because it's less than what I already have, so. Yeah. Okay. So let's take a look here, uh, what we gotta do next. Mine deep, search Lamia Meyer for the second half. Okay, so let's go ahead and find it. It's gonna be right up here. Is uh, our marker? And I'm gonna take a skimmer and get over there on the skimmer. And uh, just taking you guys over here with me for the ride because it's not very far. Keep in mind, you do get a speed boost when you have a skimmer and you're on water. So now let's check this out and see how this goes. This is called Mire Deep. All right. So we have to go over here. Now this is interesting. The symbol is a Legion trail marker, pictograms you've seen in Varar history lessons. Your sire mentioned markers in this letter. This one directs you to the southeast. Lots of trees. What's all that stuff okay. floating around though? To the I southeast. There's a marker over here. Right here. And I need to change that health skill. I think the one I want should still be unlocked. I'm not sure yet. Yep. Okay, there we go. I like using Summon Blood Fiend. So it'll transfer life to you uh, while you're fighting. And um, he'll also do damage. Or heal you. You can see my health goes up a little bit, and it's definitely out for my auto attack. Okay. So we're gonna check the tree carving. Long ago, someone carved a visible mark into the tree. It has eroded with weather and the creep and vines and moss. Another old fashioned trail marker, worn but still readable. Continues the directions mark started by the first, and it points Ghosts towards like the to northeast. Ghosts like to on you, but the joke's on them. I'm used to not hearing the enemy approach. That's gonna be up over here, and another archer, and a cat. Okay, so throw a bunch of condos. Oh, I hit the wrong target. Whoops. Okay. So there's our tree carving. The 
Door to this tree has a mark etched into it. Time has taken its toll, making the pictogram difficult to see. But it points down into the north. So we're gonna go to the north. And if it points down and to the north, I'm wondering if it's gonna be underwater. Now again, keep in mind that you can't um, use mounts or glide yet. Because technically we're scaled down to level up to level twenty. All right, and we can already see the sunken chest down here on the map because I have the uh, names on. For everything. Okay. So let's examine it. Something doesn't look quite right. So before we can open it, there is an ominous sound approaching. So let's choose some attacks here before we can get in a fight. Got some minions out. If there's a sound. That means that oh, we've got to do something. Yep, that's what we we're supposed to do. Now we can go ahead and get out of here. So we did uh, mire deep. Now we have to go and um, meet with tribute brimstone at the Imperator's core. So uh, yeah, we'll see you when we get done uh, loading in there. All right. So we're at the Imperator's Core, let's go ahead and jump in and uh, see how the rest of this goes. Um, we're still on the mission, Mire Deep, uh, but I think we're about to get that one taken care of here. Tribune, right. I have a report. I hunted down one half of my sire's key, but the other half has been stolen. Whoever did it wasn't subtle. The lock was smashed. Mm -hmm. I bet I know who's responsible. Scrapper bands like to sweep that area. Sounds like their work. Scrappers? Low-life scavengers. Do you know how I could find them? Not specifically. I'm told that a wave of scrappers from Lamia Meyer have moved on to Chargate Haven. If I were you, I'd look there first. But remember, scrappers are the undisciplined dregs of the legions. They won't respect your rank unless you make it worth their while. Or force them to. The way I see it, your options are to win them over or beat them down. Either way is fine by me. Which do you like better? Okay, so let's figure out how we're going to do this. I 
Alright, so we have two options here. Again, remember this could affect something later, so... Or the outcome. Um, the direct... So we can either take the direct approach, uh... And just go in and get it. Basically, go guns blazing. Or we can try to negotiate. Um... Let's go guns blazing. They took my property and I'm taking it back. Okay, so our next um, meeting here is going to be at Chargate Haven. Uh, we're going to force the scrappers to return the key. Let's go ahead and find where that's at on the map. It's going to be up here. Uh, it looks like it's right around Wayfair Foothills. Um, so since I don't have that unlocked, I have to run there. So I'll see you guys there in just a few minutes. Actually, shorter than that. Alright guys, so here we are at a story marker. This is actually in the other plateau, not way for our foot hills. However, that's just the easiest route that I used to get up there. Uh, so let's go ahead now and jump into the mission. This is called No Negotiations. Uh, what we're doing is we're going to go take our key back from the scrappers who probably took it. Uh, our warband is there, you just didn't see them load yet. <laughs> Listen up. I've got a job to do, and it could get rough. When the fighting starts, I want my entire warband with me. My sire, Argus Fullkiller, fought and died serving the High Legions as my inheritance. He wanted me to have a treasure his warband had claimed. Scrappers stole half of the key I need to claim my prize. I plan to get it back. I will give these carrion pickers one chance to return what's mine. If they agree, we can all go our separate ways, peacefully. If they refuse or fight, we will show them the difference between scavengers and soldiers. Ready weapons, and move out! Alright, so let's go talk. Calls. Yes. The Legion calls. Oh, okay, there we go. Just had to find the right ones to talk to you. Look here, Browget. A Citadel officer come to rub elbows with us scrappers. Should I bow? Ha! Scrappers broke open a chest in Lamia Meyer recently. That chest and its contents belong to me. Give me back my property, and nobody has to get hurt. We never saw no chest. Besides, it's just a stupid broken key. It's not like it had your name on it. That makes it fair game. Shut up now, Browget. Okay, soldier, you got us, but we found that chest fair no and way. square, and we He's took what was inside. That's the Scrapper's way. If you want it, you'll have to fight for it. That's the Scrapper's way, too. Hey, everybody, this warband says the Haven belongs to them. They're going to kick us out. Come on, let's get them before they get us. Come on, we can take these- All right, so we gotta finish this here. We gotta do it the hard way. Plenty of them coming in here. Oh, 
The best thing you do in the middle of combat like that is like find one person who just needs to be uh, loaded up with conditions and then just blast Debbie after. Oh, my so head. Make sure you're targeted I on that person with conditions and when you blast Ebby, otherwise. If you still want to head to duck with next time. You'll your, hand over my key uh, skills. now. Fine, fancy prancy citadel officer. Here's your key. I hope you rot with it in the mire. What did you say? Uh, I said I hope you got what was left by your sire. That's what I thought you said. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Alright, so again, these embroider pants. Uh, duh. Okay, these are going to be better than what I have. Alright, so we want them all on because that's for the condition damage. And we're going to work on building this one into Condi and that's what I know the most so all right so we've got another one here yet in the ruins we're gonna update Trevi Brinstone in his office at the Imperator's Corps so let's uh, head on back again we're gonna go right here and that map location by the way for where we were uh, in Diaz Plateau uh, is right up here at the very top um, of uh, Wayfair Foothill. So what I did to get there was, excuse me, was uh, I came over here to this waypoint, Horn Call Waypoint. That's going to be the one that you can pretty much always go to at any time. You don't have to unlock it. It's always unlocked for you because um, Wayfair Foothills is one of the home worlds. So um, you can kind of see my path here. I just kind of came straight up, kept going up a little further grab a couple of waypoints along the way uh, and then uh, right here at Doliac Pass uh, waypoint is where the entrance is to get into Diaz Plateau from uh, Wayfarer Foothills so I went uh, through there um, because as you can see right here is the break off point for both and right here is the waypoint um, or uh, uh, well right here is where the mission was so you know we were right there at the entrance um, I'd be trying to find and fight my way through here. Usually getting my way over here is kind of a, a pain because, like I said, um, navigating around the Black Citadel is not my best city. Uh, so, without any further ado here, let's head on over to the Imperator's Waypoint. Let's talk to Ritlock. I've been looking forward to your report, Legionnaire. How did it go with the scrappers? Did you beat some sense into them? Absolutely, sir. I've got both halves of the key, and I'm ready to claim my legacy. Good. I wonder what Argus thought was so important. And I've been cooped up in this office too long. Mind if I join you? I'd be honored, Tribune Brimstone. Excellent. I'll meet you out at the ruins and call me Ridlock Soldier. All right. So I think we've got, I think this is probably gonna be our last mission for this part. Um, we're gonna double check that. 
Uh, in just a second here, uh, we're going to open up the hero panel. You can either click on, um, if you don't already know, you can click on uh, this icon here up at the top in the uh, left hand corner. Um, or simply just press H on your keyboard. Okay, so we've got in the ruins here, this is the last one. So we're going to go ahead and meet with our re uh, warband outside of Greenwich Ruins, which is going to be up here in Diaz Plateau, uh, actually. So let's go ahead and ba go back to Chargate Haven Waypoint. Um, from there, we're going to go to uh, uh, the marker location for um, in the ruins. <laughs> So here we are in Diesel Plateau, everything's still loading as you can see. Um, let's go ahead and head over and we're going to jump on my Griffin, maybe. <laughs> I love when it glitches like this, uh, because it hasn't all loaded yet. Okay, so... We're going to cut through the little camp here. You can fly over walls, there's nothing protecting you, uh, keeping you inside the walls uh, as far as camps go, and things like that. Um, now again, we're just going to pass through everything that's going to try to attack us and just get to where we need to go. It's one thing uh, is, that is that the mounts make everything so much easier. Um, no more getting confused over spots here and there. Uh, you can tell when I'm making this, you can tell this is real. Um, so here is a Winter's Day gift as well. Uh, I am in December, today is... Uh, actually, I'm not in December anymore. Now we are in 2021, so today is uh, Sunday the 3rd. Okay, but we're not going to hang around there because I'm getting attacked and I'm just going to go start the mission here. So we're going to continue the story. And we're going to meet with everybody here. Thinky. Alright. Killings like weapons practice, but with a surprise inside. Alright, so they're all standing by. We're going to have them spread out and establish a perimeter. The only ghost you'll see in there are already in there. Okay. So here we're going to be with Ritlock. Well, Legionnaire, ready to claim your inheritance? You know it, sir. Ritlock. Let's go get it then. But we need to clear out the ghosts first. They won't let us by without a fight. I'm looking forward to it. I haven't had a good fight in... well, too long. Then let's get started. Alright, let's clear out these walking failures and get your sire's treasure. Alright, let's go. <laughs> So we're going to make sure we have our healing skills out. We're going to do that all before you start fighting. Uh, we did gain another level up here. You can also check that while you're fighting too. Just to clear it if you want. Hit accept. Close. And... Back to fighting. I really don't want to fear everybody away, I want to keep them all right here 
here, so I'm not gonna use that skill. Though I did keep forgetting that I had the staff uh, equipped as well. Okay, so you go in there, just wait for it to start, it'll start. Burn me. I don't see any treasure. Maybe someone looted it already. Tell me we didn't come all this way for nothing. We're not done yet. This is only part of Greenwich Courthouse. There's also a reservoir that I feel runs like beneath I resemble the lower my levels. Character. Snarlow. Sounds like the perfect if, place uh, to hide down. If you think I resemble Snarlow, let's find go a ahead way to tell me in the comments. Passages. Let's find what I just we're need looking the for teeth. before these ghosts come back. Big ol' fangs coming out of here. I'm right in the middle of everybody, the house getting low, and I'm gonna hit that right there. Okay, so life transfer pretty much just took care of all of them. So there's still some more we gotta fight yet. Hey, I just went through all the attacks without uh, screwing it up on my mouse. Good. Take out everything in here, I guess. Okay, so we have to find a passage here somewhere. Um, this is about the only place I need to think of to check right now is over here on the side, so... I will say that I do not already know where this extra passage is, so we are all going to have to look forward together here. I did not find it in here, although I could be wrong. A statue. Oh, wow. Okay. Right there. Alright, so it's old, broken, nearly falling apart, and it's known as seen better days. So let's go ahead and examine it a little closer. It's hastily jammed into position. We can see. Alright, let's Marcus open that up. Fulcular was a wily one. That's and that was right here, off to the, so you know, if you're inside the room, you come back out and you go to the right. So let's keep going down. Fight some more.
to our marker. We have to keep fighting along the way. That was kind of a waste of my attacks, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and check out the pile of rubble. There's an eerie glint nearby, but nothing wrong with that. So here we've got some Castellonian uh, ghosts that can pop up. I love that move. It works so well. Uh, okay, so we have another pile of rubble back here to check out. And another pile back here to check out. There's a rusted gate. And we're gonna have to fight some ghosts here. I think we have to move into here. No, uh, maybe. So it's the last place we came into. So let's see. Ascalonian treasure chest. It's preventing it from opening. Oh, we didn't fight enough. Okay. So we have another fight here, so this is going to be our boss. Okay, so it, there's a cutscene before you start fighting, okay. That's far enough. The courthouse is under my protection. No char leaves here alive. I was hoping someone would say that. Come here, Foggy. I've got a history lesson for you. And since you ghosts are such slow learners, we're going to keep teaching it to you until it sticks. move that'll break his bar, which I didn't do. Flooding the pass. Completed. Okay, so you guys can see that I haven't gone through the whole char story yet. Uh, as you can see, I just got the achievement Flooding the Pass, which you get by completing the char uh, personal story step. Um, this honorable discharge. Uh, which is what we're working on right now. So, yeah, yeah it looks like you complete... Uh, any of these steps here and um, you get the achievement so that's pretty cool and it looks like I think I got a mastery point with that one too Quite possibly. We'll see uh, at the end of the uh, story mission here, it should tell us, uh, once we get out, probably. Um, so the next thing we have to do here is, looks like we go up to that chest uh, that we were just at, that we couldn't open a second ago and unlock it. At last, the treasure. We did it, Ritlock. Now I understand why Argus's warband couldn't split the prize. This is a Diesa chalice, an old Ascalonian treasure. It may even be the last of them. How do you know that? You don't look like a student of human culture. Know your enemy, soldier. Besides, I've had to sit through more than a few human god rants. Duena this, Grenth that. Meh. I hear you. Thanks again for helping me find my sire's legacy. You're welcome. It felt good to get out again. I'm starting to think I wasn't meant for office work. 
Enjoy the chalice, soldier. You earned it. Just Real be ready to answer when I call. Office work. The next time I go out for some fresh air, I want you with me. Alright, so we get some good praise there from Ritlock. We've got a lot of um, rewards here as well to go through then. And uh, we completed it in the ruins. That's the last mission for this part, so let's take a look and see how far we got. Alright guys, so that's the end of this part um, for part two. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do part three on our next video. Uh, that is going to be, uh, I believe it's Crystal Corruption. Um, where we're going to get new orders from Ritlock in his office. Uh, so the next time I see you guys, we're going to meet you back at the Imperator's Core um, to talk to Ritlock and see what uh, our next mission is going to be. Um, if you guys have uh, any comments uh, or any questions that you want uh, answered um, regarding anything that we went through during this video, please definitely feel free to ask me down below in the comments. Um, if you do like the video, go ahead, like, and subscribe. That way you do get notified when I do have another video out for you. Um, also, uh, I'm still working on some of that Skyrim stuff that I promised as well. Uh, so that's going to be coming up soon too. Um, Alright guys, so I guess uh, we're going to see you next time. Take it easy. Live, love, play. Peace out, y'all.